guys welcome back to my channel kerja data online in this video we are going to look at the tilt sensor s w520 all right so this is the basic idea of interfacing with our sensor so this is our sensor okay so the our sensor is actually named as uh, dongrong uh, s w520 and then we are going to interface it with Arduino Nano together with the connections of the I square C over here that being attached to our LCD 16 by 2 and then we are going to create some sort of a mechanism of detection when we um, want to secure our uh, equipment or our motorbike for example and then if something happened to our um, equipment or motorbike um, it will trigger some sort of um, mechanism that alert us uh, with regard to the actions by the vibrations or any inclination of this tilt sensor so let us interface with it so first of all let us have a look uh, about the connection so the connections will be using the i square c at the a4 and a5 of arduino nano where the sda are being connected at the a4 and the sel are being connected at the a5 of arduino nano and then after that we are going to interface our ground and also the vcc of the arduino nano together with our tilt sensor if you can see over here this is our tilt sensor where the uh, vcc is being connected to one end of the tilt sensor and then another um, and are being connected with the ground together with the 10k resistor and then we are going to connect one uh, particular wire over here being connected to our d2 digital pin number two so the uh, the idea is basically the digital pin number two act like a switch mechanism that detects any change with regard to the positions of the um, tilt sensor okay so let me just do it again so when there is some tilt then it will change the status and also give some feedback towards that mechanism alright so together with me is actually the Arduino blocks you can register freely arduinoblocks.com and as usual all the codes and the idea of conducting this material are available at the descriptions of this video so the first one we make some initializations of our LCD together with the loop function over here where we specify the if else statement with regard to the tilt sensor at the pin number two so it's depend on the pin that you dedicated um, your sensor with so you can go over here on the sensor you can actually choose any type of sensor that are correspond to the idea of your uh, interfacing and then uh, we put some LCD clear and then positions the word of the status on the first row and then together the word of the safe if the condition is not satisfied or else the conditions of the other one where the inclination occur then we trigger the danger status and then we make some sort of wait for approximate 500 milliseconds so after we done doing this you can go over here at the block section and then you can download the code okay after you download the code then you can upload the code straight away to your arduino nano or you can use the console over here and then uh, do not forget to download the arduino libraries because we are going to use the arduino blocks dot uh, com libraries for the lcd okay let us have a look about the arduino code in our arduino ide okay this is our arduino code that already been downloaded from the arduino blocks.com so the, the sketch are uh, simply include all these libraries together with the initializations of the liquid crystal i square c and then we have the void setup where we begin the lcd and also the pin mode number two as the input and then we initialize the use of the lcd for displaying our message so this is the way that we uh, perform the code using arduino blocks and then it's automatically generated uh, in our arduino sketch so let us just uh, upload this code into our arduino we can choose the arduino nano together with the bootloader and our com port and then you can just click the upload button over there so after you click the upload button then the arduino sketch are going to be compiled and uh, the lcd are going to be uh, performing their initialization and then produce the output so let me just uh, wait for a while and then we can see also at our serial monitor so actually i made some 
uh, minor changes with regard to the Arduino IDE where I uh, put the serial dot print function so that we can also observe the effect on the serial monitor okay so it's uploading and then it's done uploading you can open the serial monitor and then you can see the output are going to be generated like this and then together with our LCD over here and then you can tilt it so that you can trigger the sensor that can sense the movement of the tilting mechanism towards this uh, uh, towards this interface then you if you turn to the right or you turn to the left it will detect a danger okay that's all for today guys thank you very much for watching this video if you like this video please consider to like share and subscribe and please comment in the down there if you think that this project is cool what do you think about the tilt sensor and their applications for your daily life until then see you again and happy making the arduino project see ya bye bye